everyone, this is Maggie from My Favorite Things. Today I'd like to talk to you about my Burberry collection. It's a very small collection, but I thought I would go, go ahead and review some of my items. First item that I got, and which started me on this Burberry trend, is my Burberry Merino Wool Scarf. I wrote everything down in this piece of paper because I don't know the exact names of it. But this one I got several months ago, and I love this one. This is normally... Um, right now it's February 2016 and I bought this I think in November of 2015 and I got it for $3.95 but they were, uh, the Nordstrom, or actually I got it in Bloomingdale's, Bloomingdale's was having a sale where if you buy, if you spend above a certain amount they would give you Bloomingdale's points. So essentially I got $100 off. So it's a square, large square check and it's made with merino wool like I said and it's super soft, super, super light. And what I like about this is that you can fold it. Um, you can wear it so many different ways. You can wear it long like this and just sort of wear it over your shoulder. Or you can tie it like this. So that loop it, put it through the loop. Just like that and you can see all the fringes. The other thing I like is of course you can wear it, um, you can make it into a triangle. Let me just make it into a triangle first. Triangle like this. So one side is red. Excuse my dog. <laughs> There's a yard person outside. So one side is red. So you can have a red uh, check like this, or you can have it black, black check on the other side. So it can give you a sort of a different look. And there's two different colors. One is this cream color and the other is more um, brownish tone. And I, I thought for my skin tone that this was, this made my face brighter. So I'd like this one much better. Um, so I love, love, love this um, scarf. Now I have the uh, Louis Vuitton uh, uh, large monogram scarf and I like the feel of the Burberry scarf much better. It snags less easily than the Louis Vuitton. But it, this does snag. I somehow got the, my ring caught in one of the threads and it pulled. And But luckily, Burberry store was able to send it to their um, repair person and they were able to repair it somehow. And uh, what I noticed is when I looked at it very carefully, over uh, two months of using this scarf, there were tiny little snags throughout some parts of this, this scarf. It's not, it snags less easily than a Louis Vuitton scarf but it does snag. Again, this is, in my opinion, much softer on my skin than the Louis Vuitton monogram scarf. Okay, so the next one that I have is this vest, and it's called the Brick, Burberry Brick Cranstead Stand Collar Down Vest. It's 90% down and 10% feather fill. Let me show you why I like this so much. This is Originally $4.95 or $5.95 depending on the color, but I think the price must be going up. I think it's $5.95. I got it on sale. Um, like I said, I got the scarf on sale. I got, I got most of my things, except for one, on sale. Um, so this is originally $5.95, I believe. Um, and some, some of the colors are $4.95. And then there was, it was like a hundred and, I don't know, 33% or something like that off. So if you put it zip it up like this, it's sort of loose, looser around the waist. But there's a way to cinch the waist so that it gives you a smaller waistline. So the way to do that is, let's see, right here is this little pull and you can pull it in so it's cinched in and you can do that to the other side like that. So the waist even if I don't zip it up, you can see the, the tapering in the waist, on the waistline. And of course, when I zip it up, sorry, I'm not, I'm trying not to look down, so that's why. There you go. See, there is a, more of a cinched waist look rather than a straight look a lot of the vests tend to have. And again, because this is down and uh, feather filled, it's super, super warm and super light, and it's outside is polyester, so it's very easy to slip on and off. Okay, so I highly, highly recommend this vest, and if you can find it on sale, more power to you. Okay, so next item that I, that I have, that I purchased, is the one and only one that I got with, I got it not on sale, it just kills me. 
because you can find this not necessarily on sale but you can find Nordstrom or some other big department stores having like you know points or or some uh, amount off based on I don't know loyalty points or things like that so you can get th this for a cheaper price but the the actual price they usually do not uh, they don't go on sale especially the classic colors and classic um, trench coats the heritage trench coats okay um, I did a review on this and on my other videos so I'll link that below but needless to say this is one of my favorite coats and it's very light. Um, I could layer it because I brought it a little bit looser, even though this is Sangrium, the slimmer spit. And I could, what I like about it is when, when I cinch the back like this, in terms of the belt, when I cinch, when I tie the back, with a, I'm, I'm not doing a very good job because I'm trying to do it fast. But if I do this, you can see the waistline a lot more, okay? And one of the things um, that Burberry, because I bought it at Burberry store, they told me that um, one, it has to be sent for specialty dry cleaning. And, and they told me that within three months of purchase that I can get my Burberry coat tailored to any, you know, however way I want it so that it fits my body perfectly. Um, also, every 10 years, they, you, you can send this trench coat back to Burberry and they told me that they will retreat the fabric so that it would be water repellent, you know, and, um, and, and, and sort of retouched up, I guess. Okay, my final item that I've got is this, this is called the Burberry Brit Ashurst um, Quilted Jacket. And this is a size medium. Normally I wear a size medium. I'm 5'2", 125 pounds. Normally I wear a size medium. I'm a true medium size. And this is a medium and it's very comfortable. Although I think for me, this looks very boxy. Let me button up for you. It looks very boxy and sort of loose around here. When I tried the small on, it fit me better on, the, uh, on the, my body frame but right around the chest, it was a little bit snug. So I went with a medium, but again, I think it sort of looks big on me. Um, and it's comfortable, mainly because I think it's big. Um, but, and I'm not sure if I, I like the color. This is mushroom color, and it sort of washes me out um, with my skin tone. So I think this is gonna go back. I haven't taken the tag off. I was sort of contemplating whether I wanna keep this or not. One of the things about this is this is made with polyester outside and inside is cotton and polyester blend rather than all polyester. So when you're wearing sort of a thicker sweater or, or things like that, it's a little bit like you have to sort of struggle to get it in versus if it was polyester inside, it would just slide in easier. One of the things, the nice thing about it being um, cotton inside is that um, this is what the sales lady told me, is that it, keep, it can keep you warmer. So that's a nice part. And it's a very, I mean, I've, I've been wanting this, this jacket for a long time, so I might look at it again in size small and see if that, and maybe a different color and see if that would look better. Now, if I, wear, if I buy a size small, I'm sure that I won't be able to wear, I won't be able to wear a heavy sweater underneath it. But, this, um, otherwise, it's a, it's a really nice jacket. It just doesn't fit my frame the way I like it. But it's a very nice jacket. It's light, easy to wear. Um, it has to be, again, specialty dry clean. Okay, that's all for my Burberry items. And I hope you enjoyed this video. video. And if you have any questions, um, uh, please send me a message. Thanks, bye.